Hey there, Geminis, and welcome now to Thursday. Well, I think sunny and rather chatty, the moon is in Leo. That puts emotional focus on communication. And when you're a Gemini, this is that one day when Geminis do not stop talking. You are thinking through your mouth and emotionally you are processing how you feel, especially around your ideas of long-term relationships. You might be very philosophical right now about that. The universe is putting a lot of emphasis on long-term relationships this month with the sun in Sagittarius. In fact, today, Neptune is actually ruling the day that puts you in a very cosmic vibration where you're kind of yourself and one with your partner or one with the conscious space reserved for a partner. In the next two weeks or so, Geminis are going to finally graduate a 12-year course on reinventing their ideas of marriage and partnership. And today, with the sun being ruled by Neptune, you really are kind of in the cosmic zone. This is a day where we can very clearly hear our angelic guides, our angels, our earth walkers, soul collective, God, however you want to coin it. The other side is speaking to you and listen to your long-term partnerships, especially working long-term friendships, friendships that have been there forever, because you may find literally good, important information coming from these people today through tomorrow. Then lastly, I want to talk about Saturn in Virgo. Saturn has been in Virgo for many weeks. It seems like yesterday it entered. What it means now as it approaches the end of chapter one is it's now time for Geminis to start making a decision list about what will and will not work based on survival. Now survival tends to encompass our home, the way we live, our roommates, our family, basically our relationships to our family and our relationships to our nurturing parent, which is usually the mother, but in some cases the father. Either way, now in this first chapter, Geminis are starting to see what's not going to work for them as far as survival and as far as home and family. That is the first chapter and the first conclusion towards a better, happier, more grounded lifestyle coming up next year. All right, Gemini, that's all we got for Thursday. See you tomorrow with the weekend forecast. Live, love, be. So God.